okay. Uh, well, my forehead is all shiny. Ooh. Um, my software or my hardware sucks, so this video might suck. But um, I'm going to try to show you how... It, I'm not good at explaining things, but I can at least show you in this specific instance how I'm using TomTom. Tom. Um, so you want to obviously make sure you have TomTom Tom installed and enabled. Um, and you can go to your game menu by escape. You can hit add-ons. And I've got TomTom Tom right here. It's enabled, obviously. If it were not enabled, you would want to uh, enable it, and it would say require reload, and then you would reload UI, but I don't need to do that. And then, I guess there's settings, probably. I don't even know if you did a slash command for TomTom. Tom. Okay. So, yeah, so then it'll go to interface. The other way you can do that is if you go to your escape menu, interface up here, add-ons, Tom Tom, and this guy. There's so many options. Um, I would just stick with whatever is uh, the default. So, right now I have this arrow on here. That's a Tom Tom waypoint. I can move that around, but that's not the point right now. I'm going to clear that for now so that you cannot see it. Um, and but you can also see that I have them all over this map. So these are the Jade Forest um, Lore Walker points. So what I'm actually going to do is remove all waypoints from this zone, just so I can show you how this works. Now, first you have to find the waypoints. Obviously, um, that's what the internet is for, um, and you can only put in one at a time. Usually, uh, let's see. So in the Jade Forest, here's the one right here. Actually, I have a whole. Word document that I'm going to open up. But uh, let's see, what's the first one? I don't actually know what this is for. But so the way that you add a uh, waypoint is you do a slash command way, and then you want to do the coordinates. So I put it in twice, but way. And then these coordinates are 2650, 2830. Now I put a uh, comma here, you don't actually have to, and you can also estimate, you can round it to like 27, 28, it doesn't really matter. So then you hit enter, and then you'll see that it does put this waypoint up here. Now that could vary, if I wanted to do that in a different zone, uh, I would put the zone name here, so if I wanted that to be in, um, well, what I do want is for it to be in the Jade Forest, but uh, I'm already in the Jade Forest, so I don't need to put that. If you want to put it for a zone that's different than the one that you're in, you would want to do like... that and it'll do that now that's annoying and dumb and I don't want to do that so I'm gonna see if I can find whatever that that place probably doesn't even exist oh, yeah it's right there so anyway um it's set that one up in Stormwind um but anyway I want the one in the Jade Forest of course now I have put it in and taken it out and selected it and it thinks I'm crazy it's right here okay I'm gonna remove it so you can see it again. So okay, so if I just put it in, hit enter, this arrow shows up, that's where I'm going. Um, now, then you can start flying that way. Obviously, um, I am not gonna fly all the way that way because as you can see, it would take me almost two minutes. Um, so instead, I'm gonna pick a closer one. And the way, oh here, maybe I should, um, no, I don't know how to do that. Uh, the way that I'm going to do that is that I have a site that has a list. I have two sites that I kind of have used together to put this together, and I sort of made my own list, although I didn't keep it, but I can make it again if I have to. Um, now, you can only put in one waypoint at a time. There's a ton of waypoints for the Lore Walker stuff. So, because for that, I have a, an add-on called Paste that I downloaded today. So you just click it, you paste in a bunch of stuff, you know, and then you hit... Um, paste and it would paste all of it in there um, obviously it's not going to do anything right now but okay so if I want to, this is how you could do multi-line stuff this is how I've sent um, other stuff so I could be like blah, 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 blah. Um, I'll send this to you and you'll be really alarmed this is a test don't be alarmed you will see later um, and now I'm gonna go I would normally do default for um, a waypoint but for to send it to you I'm gonna go blizzard whispers rebel barbie paste there look just sent to you a bunch of different lines so it did not send them in order which is interesting um 
weird. Okay, clear. Okay. So anyway, so then if I have a list, so this is my list of ones in the Jade Forest. Now this list is kind of messy. This is from someone else's list, and I have to use my updated list if I can find it. Let's see. Let me find my updated list, actually. Where did I put it? I know I saved that. Don't even start with me. In the desktop. It's got to be in the desktop. I hate Word. I hate the way that it does things. Just let me fucking open a file explorer like a normal person. Jesus Christ. All right. Is it here? No, it's got to be on the desktop. Sorry. I didn't think in advance that I might want to like, so let's set this up so you can see my whole computer. Where the fork? I swear to God. Mm, I know why. It's all right. Nope, maybe it was in darkness in the first place. I'm sorry, I'm dumb. Nope, okay, whatever, I give up. Never mind. I know I saved it. I saved it very intentionally, but apparently, here it is, okay. Okay, so I made my own whole list here that I kind of updated. So I've what I've done here, and that I'm pasting into paste, is, <clears throat> please don't freeze. Why are you freezing? Please don't do this. What's happening? All right, let me try that again. Unless it worked. It did not work. Okay. So, so those are all pasted in there. Now, what I've done here is I've put the Jade Forest in because when I made this list, I wasn't in the Jade Forest. And then after each of them, I've taken some part of the name of whatever the thing is that I'm going to get and put it after them so that I can know which what is which and so that I know that I don't just have random quest markers and I'm running around going, what the fuck is this? So that's the other thing that you can do is if you put a um, something after the coordinates, it uses that as kind of a label. And as you can see here, this person did not use the uh, commas. You don't have to use the commas. So because I have paste, I can paste this whole thing in. I'm not going to whisper it to you. I'm going to put it in default. Paste. And then boom, there they all are. Now, some of them are duplicate because this list is a little bit weird. Uh, if you don't want to download paste, that's fine. You'll just have to paste them in one at a time. So one line at a time. So like um, this would be one line. And then you would have to do the next line. It just takes a long time. That's why I googled how I could do it in a big block and I found this, uh, this thing paste, which I highly recommend. Um, I know it seems like a lot of stuff, but it is what it is. All right, so now that I've done that, I can see that my first one is over here, Watersmith, 829 yards. All right, and I can see that that's down here. Um, that's definitely close enough to fly to on my own. I, I pretty much always fly on my own. I wish I have something else to do. And then I'll uh, take a, a flight. But this is pretty close by, so you can see it's counting down here, the seconds. Um, I hope this is recording. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so, so blah, 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 counting down, so I kind of just come down here to find where it is. And now if I wanted to also, I could uh, move this around, but I like kind of keeping it in the middle. I can also see up on my mini map over here. You can see that little guy right there it has the label. It has what, how far away it is, and it says the Jade Forest, it has the coordinates. Now one thing that it does do, and you can turn this off, is that if, once you fly right through it, it disappears. So you saw it real quick, it disappeared and went straight to the next one. Now I don't want to get confused by that, so right now I'm clicking clear waypoint from Crazy Arrow. What that does is it just hides it. It does not delete it from the map. Remove waypoint deletes it from the map. Remove all waypoints from this zone, deletes them all from the zone. Remove all waypoints, deletes all of them from the world. Probably don't do that. Um, sometimes I do remove all waypoints from this zone. But mostly it would be remove waypoint if I wanted to. However, this one is one that I still want to get to. Uh, so I'm clearing it from the crazy arrow. And then later when I want to, I can go in the map. I can right click it and I can set as waypoint arrow. But I'm not going to do that right now. So here I am. And these lore walker things all kind of look like this. This blue sparkly business. You know, don't get in my way. And um, click on it. You'll get a little achievement progress. You'll get a little story that I know you won't read. I like to click on this and see how far I am. But like, so I just need one more for fishtails. Um, and then once I do get fishtails, for example, uh, you can see up here I have mail from Warwalker Cho. Uh, I will for each full achievement you get mail from him, and then at the end you bring it all to him and you get a bunch of rep. Is my understanding. Anyway, so I've done that. So now I'm gonna get back on my flying mount. 
I'm going to go back to my map, and so my closest next one is over here, uh, Emp Bird 3, which is Emperor's Burden 3. So I'm going to right click on it, set as waypoint arrow, and there it is. And I just do the whole thing over again. So um, that's Tom Tom. Um, if you need help installing add ons, I can make a video for that too. Maybe I might run out of video making energy. Um, anyway, uh, the end, and I love you.